Day of a struggling Crystal Palace and they're beginning to move into the picture. Well, the Scottish Cup's long and winding trail begins next week with the first round proper, but uh, for clubs from the Highland League and uh, from the South, the road began some time back with their respective qualifying cups. The final of the South qualifying cup went ahead at Netherdale this afternoon. Gala Ferridine against Vale of Leithen, and Chick Young was there. Strictly speaking, the action at Netherdale was a football invasion of rugby territory, with the Gala versus West First Division 15 a side fixture vying for box office trade next door. But Gala Shields has its own football heritage. Very Dean include in their lineup Norrie and Neil Collins, brothers of Celtic's John, and they've already beaten Vale of Leithen twice in three meetings this season. But the lads from Inner Leithen are clearly not interested in the form book. Ten minutes gone, it's strike one to the Vale, and the scorer. Elliot Gray. He did particularly well to keep control in a surface which carved up badly as the afternoon progressed. But it was far from good news all the way for Vale. Long-serving team captain Stevie Bird took a bad one in this rare gala attack. And tonight he's in a local hospital suffering with a badly broken leg. Of some slight consolation to him might be the performance of his teammates who went on to totally dismantle Gala. Goal number two was a gem and again the scorer was Elliot Gray. A superb far post header after really intelligent work down the left. Into the second half, and Gala were being further taken apart. By now, there were huge gaps at the back, and Big John Thorpe was just the boy to say thank you and good night, Gala. On the other hand, Neil Nisbet was clearly suffering from agoraphobia, the fear of wide open spaces. And talking of wide open spaces, here comes goal number four as Gala pushed forward and left a back line which was manned like the Marie Celeste. Big John Thorpe clocks in with his second goal. 4 0 Bill of Leithen and cue the celebrations. The magnificent qualifying cup is handed over by SFA President Peter Gavner and the lads from Inner Leithen prepare to follow on with a little singing and dancing. And while that's happening, Big John Thorpe does the talking. Marcus Roy and that. We've got a couple of goals. We've got off a good start with Elliot. Two goals in the first half for him. Sorry we lost the captain in that early doors, so he's broken leg. We'll be up to see him later on with the cup. Make sure he's celebrating with us. That's bad news, because you must have felt the way the, the game went, the quality of your team. You can maybe do a job in the Tenant Scottish Cup proper. Yeah, I hope so. We're unlucky last year. We should have beat us 2-1 in a lead in. Thought we played well. Yeah, we'll go out and get our best. Same as what we've done today. Hope we win. Do you think sometimes the rest of Scotland ignores your standard of football? 